Do you know what it is yet? Am, am I wrong if I don't get it? Oh no! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Tio, turn it off! I'm really, really scared. <laughs> I don't want to look. <laughs> oh boy, well that wins creativity award. Um, <laughs> you honestly can't see right now, but I'm getting a little bit, just a chill went down my spine. All right, well, <laughs> just jump into it. Get it over with, for freak's sakes. Come on, Tim, press start. Oh, God. Oh, no. So how do you know about this game? <laughs> I know this game. I believe it's through Kedicarus. Right. How do you know this game? I know about it because it was a childhood uh, game. Got it. Oh, joy. I have a great yeah, idea. it's fantastic. This year, the Who's will pay. Oh my god. Best childhood. Well, that's just a very scary childhood. Yeah. Fantastic. Did they match? Did they match him to look like Jim Carrey? Uh, no, not really. I don't my think it's based around that. I believe it's based around the original story. All my inventions, my contraptions, well, he my looks Machiavellian machine. really scary. <laughs> He's the Grinch. Alright, well, I'm excited. I'm excited to see what, what this is all about. Where is there, is there a cutscene? Th this is a cutscene. Is he speaking? He is. Should I mute my microphone? No. <laughs> Three step I don't process. do that here. <laughs> I, don't, yeah, I don't do that. I don't give a shit. <laughs> also, I, I, I edit things. No, I cut no, you out if I want to. <laughs> like, literally, I could just cut you. This is a one-sided conversation. Thank you. You're not even here. You're sending me your audio for no reason. <laughs> yeah, I feel so included. No, but, uh, Teal doesn't- Grinch doesn't interrupt Teal. Teal interrupts Grinch. Is that how it works on your channel? Uh, yes. you, you interrupt so, skipping that. cutscene. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that face! <laughs> Some, something about that for me is just so cringeworthy. Like, when you guys were talking over them in Sonic Boom, I'm like, you guys! <laughs> but it's fine. Anyway, here we go! Does or that really- go, Does that really bother you? I well, I don't. It, no, it doesn't bother me. It's like no, I. There I don't know. Be a spare I guess it's just me. I mean, I can still watch the video the and be happy. Like be perfect, but I can still hear them. I can still hear you. Yeah. But um, I mean, just for me, I guess it, it, it was my way of recording. No, I I mean, like each way He'll works for like, a separate person. To attain all his goal. You know what I mean? Maybe not. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Cool. Anyway, let's. What is? What is? What is this? I'm really nervous. This is the Grinch. Well, I've gathered. Yeah, it is a game oh that is gosh. quite simply okay. <laughs> Very okay. Alright, so. Cadillacs. Yes. He was on the channel too. What was that? Was he here during uh -huh. the Christmas time? Uh, yeah, he was, uh, he joined me for the last two videos of, uh, Santa Claus Days. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, that was, um, that, oh, actually, no, it might have been three videos, but no, that was, um, that was really nice because I um, I had him on my channel because uh, we did a uh, like a basic uh, a reaction video. It was a I think like two hour conversation between me, Gold IDS, uh, him, and uh, Safazen. Uh, okay. Basically, just just uh, talking about the uh, the PS the press conference that basically announced the PS4. It was a big deal, obviously. Oh yeah. Um, yeah. And we uh, we we talked about that. Um, and we had fun, we had fun, we talked for a couple of hours afterwards, but we just hey, never really, we never really me, kept in contact, boy. one of those, like, things, because he doesn't do Let's Plays, and I don't yeah, know, yeah. often, like, it's just not the same chemistry, mm -hmm. um, but it's just fine, I'd love to work with him more in the future, and I'm sure we would, um, but, yeah, uh, but I asked him, I was like, if he's interested, but Santa Claus saves Earth, because, you know, it's a, it's a pretty great, yeah, yeah, it's a pretty great thing to, you know, like, you inspired me to do it, so, do you want to... Do you want to try Go, your hand at commentating? What a, what a great thing suffer? to be inspired by as well. Just do like, you want to yeah. suffer with me? Please do. I don't want to do this alone anymore. <laughs> and he was just like, yeah, I'd love to. You're crazy enough to try and get to the final level. Why not? I'm like, yeah, I am. Let's, let's do it. <laughs> so, awesome. Thanks. You're That's cool. so it happened. It was, it was a lot of fun. I had a yeah. lot of fun recording with him. It was, it was a great set of videos as well. It turned, mm. it turned out really good. It was very funny. Mm -hmm. But, uh, yeah, no, I hopefully in the future we'll record some more. I want to do reviews more, but I really just haven't had time. Like, with Chain of Memories, I'm like, right, going to do this alongside Chain of Memories. No, I'm not. 
<laughs> that ain't <laughs> happening anymore. I mean, yeah, no I mean, I can't really say a lot of our reviews until they did like two when they were really, really bad, but I do think reviews just take more time. Oh, they do. Because you have to, I mean, I'm not sure if you did it, but you have to like script it, you have to edit it, you have to find Yeah, no, no, I am. Yeah, I I spent ages, I've... Also, I've got a review um, odor, of Bubsy 3D, which oh, I'm working joy. on, um, and legitimately, I've I've worked on it for about two oh years, <laughs> changing, reiterating no it, trying to work out different things because yeah, it's just, yeah. there's so much I have to do for it. But I'm really happy with how it sounds <laughs> and how it works. It's just it's really funny. Yeah. Um, I mean, obviously, I'm. I can't really speak myself. I'm heavily biased. Press the um, but to I, I've sent the script to people, and they were just like, this "Oh, like, this is really good." Yeah, um, I, and there's well, just there's oh, just so yes. many different, like yeah. there's so many different things. Like I know I mentioned this to Kadikus when I first uh, talked to him, like saying I'm thinking of doing a review of Bubsy 3D. Um, he was just like, "Be careful," because obviously, like John Tron did Bubsy first. The heart, the but at the same time, um, he never really covered much on 3D. He covered the first Bubsy more. Wait, what do you mean by like "be that. careful"? <laughs> it's like a threat there. <laughs> well, no, but because it's like people, if you like, to try not copy what he did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 You, like, if you've seen a review already, you might Eric accidentally Miles steal their jokes. Yeah, I, I guess more, I, I guess more like a heads up. Yeah. Because obviously you, it's plagiarism. Just like you've got to be careful. Um, and even so, you, yes. and even as well, like if you accidentally like appear. say one thing that's similar to another person, and some people can just really, um, yeah, sort of take dig that a lot. Yeah, and dig into yeah. you about it. Yeah, it's it's just ridiculous. Even if it's not your fault, like I I know I I know people who created things and they just didn't actually know that someone else had done something similar. It's way yeah, down yeah. In Hoover, it's, it's just really unfortunate. Hoover the problem is the world is full of in, incredible original people and, and two people are going to have the same idea. It's yeah. just who's going to do it first mm. and who's going to do it better. Sometimes the first person will do both those things. Yeah. The and first person will obviously be first. But you know what I mean. The, they might also do the better version. Um, and that's, but that's, I like to think I like to think a review of Bubsy 3 d I'll be able to do better than John Tron. The only reason I say that is because John Tron is amazing. Don't get me wrong, I absolutely adore John Tron with all of my soul. But um I feel that his review, as I said before, doesn't well, focus on Bubsy 3D. It focuses on the first the one more and just sort of hope that addresses it. And, yeah. and, and, just and I feel that my the jokes are actually much more varied and funny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, like, when some people... I mean, I'm not trying to say that anyone's going to hate on you in the comments because clearly it's your video, but I'm saying, like, some people get really, really mad when people say, like, oh, yeah, I think in this category I'm going to be better than the other person. And some people are like, how can you say that? You know, like, that's so rude. But I think to a degree, like, if you know you're right and if other friends of yours know that you're right as well i don't see what the big deal is like, no say... i think I, I i think saying it's better i think is actually unfair like it it's going to be different because well, obviously guess... they they won't they the mission book yeah it's, okay. it's all um objective to -list. Um, yeah, I, yeah i guess you could say yeah it's sort of all a matter of opinion that i guess that depending on who's watching one what. important task yeah i i think i think mine is arguably better in the sense that it is more focused on 3d if you're comparing 3d to 3d and not everything that he yeah. does. But I mean, like, um, I guess one can be overall better than the other one. Yeah, I think, so I I think suppose... in terms of reviews, he's always going to be better than me. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, for... Yeah, for... Thumbs of Freedom, I think... I, I just think I've done something really good with it. Mm. I just well, need I'm to like, I look forward to seeing it. I just have to actually make it, and it will take a lot of time. Yeah. But... Because it is... There's a lot for it. Like, I've got... I've got to. Re the Grinch just without spoiling too much, I have to swear egg. in the middle of Take town whilst doing an interview. Oh, quote unquote interview. This vile, oh. fragile items you like, I have to shout. <laughs> I have to shout fucking. To in the middle fuel. of town. Like, that's the idea I have. And it will be really hard to pull off because I'm going to do two. I'm going to do it in two ways. I'm going to do it the first way, um, silent, mimicking it, um, and then dubbing over it. The other way. Is basically, um, I actually do it and run. <laughs> that, that's, yes. that's the other way, um, because I have an idea of where I'm going to do it, yeah. and depending on what time it is, which kind of any time it will be busy, it just will be. Well, but I look forward to doing it. It'll be fun. <laughs> Sounds like fun. Yeah. Just make sure. Just make make sure you're fast too. 
Oh, I am. I'll be. I won't be alone. I'll be filming with someone else. Oh, that's I'm not another sure. one. Awesome. Well, actually, no. I, I have an idea. But, yeah. Well, I look forward to seeing how it turns it, out. It will be. It will be a good video, I'm sure. Um, because I will put a lot of effort into it. Because yeah. I want to do more reviews. Reviews are mm -hmm. fun. Like I'm gonna be doing a top ten a games of the year of again. Stealth. I always yeah. do. If I find it's um, just so satisfying to like get one part of the script right. Like you're talking so fast and you just nail it. It's like yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, there's satisfaction for sure with reviews. Yeah, there, there is that. Anyway, as you were saying, I interrupted you. No, no. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know what's. Like, I honestly don't know what's gonna be on my top ten games of the year. Hmm. Like it's really, it's really interesting with this year because some scoundrels are because like there were some games that loads of people loved and i just didn't yeah. hyrule warriors being one of them oh really I, didn't like I, hyrule warriors. I, i'm not that was a, a great huge, game i'm not a huge fan of dynasty warriors i could never get into it yeah yeah fair enough i i just i didn't really find it that much fun personally um yeah. so i'm not actually gonna put it on the list what about um, mario, mario Kart 8 for sure has to be on there oh yeah of course that was a It'll great game somewhere. Um, the Wii U, the Wii U sort of just blew this sort of year out of the water, I think. Like yeah, they had some well, really I, great stuff. Um, yeah, that's. I'm trying to think if there was something that was exclusive I mean, like, on another console that I preferred. The Last of Us I mean, remastered. I, well, yeah, I mean, I, I love Kingdom great. Hearts. Kingdom Hearts, obviously. Yeah, yeah. That's gonna have to take. I, I don't know where that's gonna be on the list. It's gonna be high up. Um, yeah, for sure. Well, it's, it's one of your favorite games too. So. Well, I Kingdom, so. Hearts, Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix was my favourite game of all time. And well, now it's then. been remade in HD, so you know, it's kind of biased. But I, yeah. it is very, it's, it, to an extent, it's the same as before, so I can't mm. rank it first. I just can't put it first. Yeah. It, it's technically like cheating. Yeah. Um, I mean, but like. I think. I, I know Skylanders Trap Team will be high. Mm. Definitely. That I was, actually haven't played a Skylanders game since Giants. Fair enough. No, that's uh, that's not necessarily a bad thing. Swap Force was okay. It yeah. it wasn't bad. It was just rushed, unfortunately. And that's it, was, never it didn't have the same charm as Giants did. Yeah, Giants was great. I actually loved mm. that. Oh, I mean, was. like Skylanders is one of those games that I feel like I feel like for me, as you know, I I, I just didn't. I don't feel like I was as big as like a part of the fan base as a lot of other people were. Like it just wasn't. It was a great game, but it wasn't Another one of my one. favorite games. If that makes yeah, sense. Yeah, no, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It, it was. It, don't get me wrong. It's just the way. Um, I can really sort of uh, appreciate the way how it worked. You know, with like the toys and stuff. Mm. And that is absolutely. Um, not trying to just completely um, generalize this to the children, but it was a great way to get like the kids as well as a part of that game yeah no. every kid likes to have a little toy or whatever but it was great it was, it was a great game with toys or without them so i think the biggest problem i have with trap team like i i think i gave it something like 96 out of 100 mm. and like honestly i think like the biggest problem i had with that game um was genuinely the fact that uh certain doors had to be open with Skylanders, which is with, with um, Element Skylanders, which I'm yes. fine with because they've done that before. Mm -hmm. However, the from my hand is it had to be open with an Element specifically from a Trap Team member. Um, and I'm oh. just like, really? Did yeah. it really need that? Could it not just be an Element again? I mean, like everybody else, like if you've already gone to the effort to buy the Skylanders, I don't really see why they sort of pull that move. I mean, clear. I, hmm. I don't want to say comments like and be offensive. To complete That's the all thing. his missions. Mm. Like I don't, I don't want to, uh -huh. I don't want to completely as well like just generalize something because maybe they thought it would be cool or, but I, th I th well voice crack, but I think it may have been something to do, possibly with money. <sighs> well, yeah. Yeah, I mean, and I, I hate to say comments like that just because I feel like such a well, meanie, but, well, you're not wrong. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Um, I'm yeah. pretty sure money was a very high factor in that decision. For sure. Um, but I mean, the thing I like, the thing I uh, like like about it in that sense is you're not forced to buy them. Yeah. I'm like, yeah, you can still progress through the story <laughs> without having to buy yeah, the optional you, tools. Yeah, you don't need to. So. And like, the thing is, like, you, like, there's oh, you you have to buy like a hundred skeletons. No, you can buy the ones you want to buy if yeah. you want to buy them. Like, and there, there are some that I genuinely think, actually, you know what? That's really cool. I want to yeah. own that. <laughs> I want to yeah. play as that character. I mean, yeah, some. I guess it's, it's yeah. I guess some toys like caught my eye more than others. Mm. Like, if there was, like, for me, if I were to be playing 
Um, what was the one with the optional optional doors? Did you say trap team? Wasn't it? Uh, yeah, it was yeah, the so, trap masters. Yeah, because if it was for trap team and it was one that um, like if it was like a, an optional door and there was a toy for it that I didn't feel like was that cool, I probably wouldn't end up getting it. But if there was one for a toy that was pretty cool, I guess I could see myself <laughs> getting that one. Yeah. Probably. If you see, yeah, pretty much what you just said. <laughs> mm. No, I know what you mean. Yeah. Awesome. But yeah, so um, what else has been on there? I mean, I've played some games that I feel really lacked a lot of new stuff. I played, um, uh, well, you haven't played, you have Far Cry 4, but you played Far Cry 3, did you? Uh, no, I haven't played Far Cry 3. I've played bit, bits of Far Cry 4. I'm enjoying it so far. It's quite Far, fun. far Cry 4, it, don't get me wrong, it's a fun game. I'm pretty sure if you like Far Cry 3, you're gonna end up liking Far Cry 4, but I just feel like it lacked the feel of its own game. Like, yeah, there was too many great. similarities in terms of gameplay and missions. I just feel like it sort of took that mission and sort of modified it to match the land of um, Karat or Far Cry 4 or whatever. So I just feel like they modified a lot of things. And the same sort of goes for Borderlands 2 and Borderlands the pre-sequel. They did a lot of sort of... They is paid... Is pre-sequel any good? Pre-sequel is fun, but it's... It was kind of yeah, like yeah. I would say right. was, I'd say Borderlands 2 is more worth your time than the pre-sequel. Fair enough. I mean, I have uh, one and two, I just haven't played them. Uh, I was planning on playing them with Storybook. Mm -hmm. we, I ended up uh, playing... I played it a little bit back when I'd never really played any FPSs and was terrible at it. Yeah. Uh, ended up playing it with her. Had a blast! Really fun to play online co-op. Yes, it really um, is. And it was just, it was, you know, it's a, it's a really good game to do with. And I, I assume Borderlands 2 is much the same in terms of yeah, how yeah. well made it is. Yeah, um, I mean, Borderlands pre sequel, I guess I would sort of, it's a better game to play with friends than by yourself. I right. think that's sort of coded it as well with a little bit more fun, was being able to play with your friends online. I think sort of made the story just a little bit better, you know what I mean? Mm, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, I, it's, I, it's, know, yeah. I know one specific game which will be extremely high. I honestly, I haven't made the list, I don't know what's going to be where. But mm -hmm. I know it's going to be extremely high, um, and I do know where this is going to be. Um, but I'm not going to say where, but, um, Pokemon, um, Omega Ruby, Alpha Sapphire. Yeah, you see, I've been trying, like, um, I've been trying really hard to not spoil myself, like, not spoil, not sp yeah, spoil myself, but not, like, to spoil the game for me. Um, right. and even, I know, like, I know, like, it's, has, I mean, I know there's clearly going to be some different, like, a lot of different things to X and Y, clearly, Ow. but I still oh, feel yeah. like, I still feel like, you know, the, the design, to a degree, is similar to X and Y. So I know, I know some things about the game, but like, if I'm really not the person to talk to about like, um, about Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, because I really have tried, <laughs> like, I've tried so hard to not educate myself on the game. So it's just like a completely new experience. Is it, are you getting it for Christmas or something? Um, I put it on my birthday list, so. Oh. Oh, when's your happen. birthday? December the 16th. <laughs> oh, okay. So yeah, we should actually probably be posting the final episode of the series two days after. Ooh, maybe. Ooh. Depending on how we do things. Yeah, depending on how we do things. How I post them on my channel is my business. <laughs> <laughs> that, is, that, is, that is true. Wow, jeez, I feel like such an intruder. Yeah. Um, I'm sorry. gonna post it how I like. Four days in a row on Christmas Day. No, I don't know. Yeah, um, you can, yeah it's, it's yours too. No, I'm not gonna do that. I don't know how I'm gonna do it. <laughs> yours too. Um, but yeah, the... Um, hey, we could post it on the same day. Oh my uh, gosh. Oh my god. No, no, I don't. Oh. Um, but no, yeah, uh, you you can compare it to X and Y, which is perfectly understandable, yeah. considering, you know, um, it is what it is. But I would compare it more to the original. Um, yeah, I could see how that would work, comparing it more to the game that's actually based off of the yeah. X and Y. I mean, if we're talking in terms of, like, I mean, clearly, it's a completely different look than the originals. Yeah, Re I, really clearly. I mean, it is, but at the same time, it really has the feel of yeah, yeah. The well, I guess, uh, for which me, is something I was worried about. Yeah, I was me, really worried it wasn't gonna feel <laughs> like yeah. um, Ruby and Sapphire because the, Sapphire was my first ever Pokemon game. Yeah, and Sapphire I was, was, I was a just, really well made game. I was really worried it was gonna feel like too much like X and Y. Mm. I like X and Y, I really do, but I feel like it was just it was very boring in areas and just yeah. it, it felt too slow and it, it just. It felt it, too. I mean, not saying that Pokemon is like, well, so far for me being the biggest one for plot twists, but it was so obvious who yes, that was the guy in, in charge of Team Flare. It was clearly Lysander. We knew that straight from the beginning. I knew that straight from the beginning, at least. I mean, it yeah, was sort no, of a big did. giveaway. Yeah. 
No, I, I completely understand what you're saying. Yeah, it, so like, it was it was very obvious. It was, about it was that, disappointing, just... really. Yeah, I mean, like, but I feel was... like there, there could have been something a lot bigger with X and Y. Cause yeah, I was just, like, as soon as I saw him, I was just like, your hair, there is no way you're not Team Flair. Yeah, I like, know. You yeah, have, runs. you have the, well, yeah, you, <laughs> you have the colour, you have a very crazy style, you just, you have to. Yeah, of course. But, and um, another thing as well for me was, um, or I guess not really in terms of X and Y, but one thing, I'm not too sure in terms of battling and stuff, and in terms of how competitions are going to go, there's a lot of mega evolutions added in now. Like, yes. so many. Rayquaza which, is completely OP. Yes, he looks awesome. You like, get to go to freaking space, because I saw him last awesome. stream. Yeah. No, he, he is awesome, but he is genuinely, like, completely yeah. overpowered. I, I think in terms of, I mean, I'm not too sure if you know about, like, competitions. Well, you clearly know about competitions, but, like, I think I, they, they, they have to do something to, like, mellow it out. Like, I'm not, I'm not sure if there's going to be, like, a rule on Megas or something <laughs> when it comes to competitions. Um, probably. Like, as I could see, yeah, just a team of, of Megas getting... Pretty, well, you, how many Mega Evolutions can you do per... It's only one per... Yeah, one per battle. Um, per, per battle, yeah. Okay, so then... Hang on. Hmm. Well, if you're, if you're using Rayquaza, then... Well, yeah, but if you if you, if you have Rayquaza, it, it literally can one-hit anything. So it's just like, it's... Yeah. There's oh, some... I got, I there's some... Map. Oh. Well, oh, are we breaking the game? Or is this what this uh, is I to? was trying to. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't know how I did it, but I was trying. Can't you go of the map in, um, which game is it again? It's Spyro 2, isn't it? Uh, oh, yeah. yeah. Definitely. 100%. Every level. Awesome. Yeah, um, the, uh, the double jump glitch. Mm. I'm trying to think of, oh. um... Well, but yeah, so the Pokemon high, games... Higher jump, hover glide, but yeah. Yeah, so the Pokemon games are gonna make it up there on your list then. Yeah. Oh god, yeah. Um... What else? what else? Yeah, no, because like Yoshi's New Island, definitely. Oh that yeah, was for so sure, it was a great fun. game. Yeah, yeah music game was, awesome. was fantastic. Mm -hmm. Loved it. it was Levels great. were great. Yeah. Mm, boring, yeah. dull, not fun. Yeah. You know how I be, I, Have you seen my other top ten games of the year? I years? did see. Um, I did see. I, I remember your honorable mention is more than that. Did the actual yeah. list? R Rayman yeah, Legends the, was the, number one, wasn't it? Yeah. The yeah, honorable mentions, like, uh, well, the, um, Tumor, you know how I always do a fake number one? Yes, wasn't yours, like, the Jack and Daxter Lost Frontier or something? No, it was, um, I ended up doing, uh, my fake number one was, um, uh, Star Trek, the oh, game, yeah. uh, Call of Duty, and, uh, Sonic Lost World. Oh, wow. Um, uh, people genuinely thought it was Lost World. I did it really convincingly. Uh, which is what I was actually really happy with. Um, but no, not that. Uh, I honestly have no idea what I have to do. Um, if I'm going to be honest. Um, but yeah, the the game that I... If only I could not be recognised. Oh, how do you... Oh yeah, I have to get a different costume, don't I? I don't remember where I get that, but... Um, yeah, so... This year, I, I I wonder if Sonic Boom will be number one. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Sonic games really need to pick up the pace. I well, mean, like... admittedly, this one actually wasn't made by Sega, so. Mm. I mean, that's not entirely their fault. The thing, thing I don't get, like Generations was perfect, so why? I, I like Generations. Yeah, Generations is amazing. It's it's by far one of the best Sonic games ever. I, made. Well, I, yeah, I really did like Generations. Another one I like though that I don't think, I mean. I found that it got too much hate was um, w Unleashed. Yeah, I love now, Unleashed. I, Unleashed, sure, some of the home worlds would lag a bit, but really, who cares? Like, Which version did you play out of curiosity? PS2. PS2. Okay, yeah, I was gonna say PS2 and Wii version are different to the Xbox 360 and uh, PS3 version. Yeah, uh -huh. for the PS2, the home worlds, I did notice they did have some lag to it, actually. But like, yeah, I, occasionally, but I, I, loved I didn't. It. it wasn't that big of a deal. Like, to be honest, the Werehog. Even though people said it was boring, I had fun playing as the way. Yeah, I had fun with it. Like, something, but I would actually love to do a let's play of it actually at some point. Yeah, no, I had a lot of fun with Unleashed. I thought I thought the Werehog was fun. I mean, the thing I like about the Werehog is it has loads of combos. Something that Sonic Boom fails consistently yeah, yeah. at. There's like yeah. one attack and that's it. Mm -hmm. I, just, I, I just I just really like uh, Sonic Unleashed. I mean, I love those are the Sonic games that I really like to play too. Like the ones where you just sort of like explore like that. I don't know. 
some other game. One that I really want to play is Sonic Colors. Colors is great. Colors is mm -hmm. really good. It's a lot of fun. I still feel that it, it, it feels different to Unleashed and Generations. It's very, yeah. it's really interesting because the style is the same, but it it just has a very different feel. And it's not just yeah, because yeah. it's on the Wii or anything. It's just genuinely different. I don't actually know what it is. Mm. I, I, I couldn't really figure it out. It just feels different. But it's it is a lot of fun. Don't get me wrong. Yeah. I think it's I think it's a great game. Yeah, 